am back with another video. Today is the 31st of December. So that means it is New Year's Eve. So Happy New Year's to every... New Year's. There I go. Happy New Year to everyone. I am coming to you all with a what did I get for Christmas video. I should have been doing this before, but... I got injured and I have staples in my toes, so it delayed my recording. Anyways, I want to show you guys the f the best gift that I've ever probably gotten in my life for Christmas. I think, other than like a lot of cash, but anyway. So I have been asking for this particular product for so long, y'all. Like y'all don't even understand, but I wasn't here to spend that money on myself. I know, I know. But anyways, y'all, look. And then I hold it up backwards. Do y'all see this? Y'all. Y'all understand what's about to go down right now? Like, y'all see this? So, my wife got me this for Christmas. And there were, uh, I, I needed to show y'all. So, I'm getting ready to do a unboxing, not unboxing. Let me switch my camera out. I'll be right back. So, y'all, I have the new camera set up. And I wanted to show y'all what else I got for Christmas. This had to be, like, the greatest Christmas I've had in a very long time. My face looks slim, don't it, y'all? So, anyways, let me say this. Do not judge me because I had to tie my hair up because I still have these braids in my hair, y'all. So, I haven't been able to take my hair out. That's a whole nother story. So, don't judge me, okay? But I still look cute. Right? Anyway, so this is what else I got for Christmas. I have to do this stuff in sections, y'all. You know why? Because I had a lot of great Christmas gifts this year. I truly, truly did. But, of course, you know, everything's not about materialistic things. So, I'm not even going to put a disclaimer because y'all know I don't brag. I don't have, you know, I don't, that's, that's not in my demeanor. I don't brag. But... I did want to show you guys because I'm very thankful because my friends and family did, you know, think about me, you know? Anyways, so, y'all, I was, let me show y'all this. I got, like, four bags worth of stuff from Victoria's Secret this year, like, for real, for real. So, let me show y'all what I got from Victoria's Secret. So, the first thing that I got, my best friend um got for me and if you know me you know i love victoria's secret heavenly like this is my favorite fragrance ever in life i don't know why but i love this fragrance so this gift set came with a fragrance wash um it came with a large perfume as well as a, like a travel size perfume and the lotion so once again this was like everything to me. She also got me a pair of the pink slides. They look like this. So thank you again, boo. I appreciate that. Um, I also got some more stuff in this bag. I got another heavenly this was in my stocking actually so i got another heavenly because everybody knows i love heavenly and i also got a gift set that came with four different um products and it came with a flavored gloss a beauty rush flavored gloss and this is candy baby so y'all gonna have to work with me because you know i got this camera i don't know i hope it auto focuses um, I also got Victoria's Secret uh, Bombshell, the little, is it a rollerball? I don't know if this, I think this might be the small, just the small um, pump spray. And it also came with a hydrating body lotion in coconut milk. Oh, look at that autofocus, baby! <laughs> we in here! Okay, sorry, I just got excited real quick. Um, and it also came with Victoria's Secret blush. And yeah, so th that ain't it. it. That ain't it. That was just a small bag. Um, 
I also got like y'all I have become in 2016 I was super 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 obsessed with the pink line I don't know why I don't know when it happened but did y'all know that shit expensive get your friends and family that'll buy you pink cause that stuff is expensive and I'm cheap with myself not with everybody else but I'm cheap with me so for Christmas they bless me you know they bless me so this is what I got. I got some underwear. I'm not gonna really be like, oh y'all, look at these drawers. But I just did it. <laughs> so I got these underwear and like I said, I got quite a couple pair, you guys. You know, so I got all of these. I'm not gonna show every little detail of them. But um, yeah. These, y'all, I don't know if y'all know, but pink my favorite color, so I'm gonna show y'all these because I didn't even know that this was on there. So I got these. Aren't these cute? And then look on the back, y'all. These are so cute. Let's say pink, but it's my favorite color. Cute, okay? Um, And I also got this shirt. Oh, uh, can you see it? All right, so it says pink, I think, just kidding. It says pink on the pocket, and then it has the little detailing on the sleeves, and then it says pink down the side. That was really, really cute. I also got this shirt, and it's just a pink shirt with the dog on the side and then it says pink on the on the sleeves I also got this shirt as well it's a pink pink shirt a pink pink shirt <laughs> and on the front has the dog on the back has a bigger dog and then of course on the side it has pink on the side because everything pink says pink right um now i got these as well these are the flat flare regular let me tell y'all something okay let's have a, a a brief little conversation just because you plus size does not mean you can't wear pink and that's why i think i've become obsessed with pink because in the year 2016 i lost um about 40 something pounds and i had to stop going to the gym because i had a lot of stuff going on but when my toe heels is going down but um it's a lot of things that you can get in you just have to try it out um i know the campus pants if you wear between like a one maybe a 2x because i usually wear a 1x sometimes a 2x it just depends but you can get into the large you just got to try it on and see what works for you um but i got these yoga pants and of course they say pink on the back they're just the plain black yoga pants and then they have of course love pink on the side can you see it yeah love pink so i got those and um this also came with my this little dog i'm probably gonna give it to my daughter it's a oh no 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 it's a collectible dog so if i gotta start collecting pink then somebody gonna have to get their pockets ready just kidding um on what was that night black friday slash thanksgiving day thursday which everybody goes shopping on thursday now because i know i do they had 25 dollar 25 dollar t-shirts and the pants uh the yoga pants to go with them so these are things that i actually bought myself and I got the maroon, are these considered yoga pants? Yeah, maroon yoga pants. And they have pink going down, yeah, pink going down the side. And I I also got the, um, oh, I'm sorry. It wasn't 25 for the t-shirts. It was 25 for the half zip, I guess, whatever they call it. The half zip, y'all know what I'm talking about. I got it, but it's in my suitcase, and my suitcase is in the trunk, and it's been in the trunk since November. 
I'm just throwing shade at my wife because she's sitting on the couch and I was supposed to get, <laughs> I was supposed to have my suitcase in the house to show y'all, but guess what? It's still in the trunk. Tell them they can come there and go get it. I'm not gonna dignify that with a response. Anyways, y'all, I haven't even opened this yet because I was waiting to show y'all. Um, so I got, like I said, I got the maroon yoga pants and I also got the yoga pants. I guess this is like lavender. So it's the same, it's the same, pretty much the same thing, but it's just in a different color and pink. And all of this stuff that I got is in a large. So like I said, plus size women, you can wear them. Now, those underwear are hit and miss. Some of them are like, yeah, go ahead and do your thing. And some like, girl, put them things on back, okay? Just saying. I don't want to, you know, I don't want to set y'all up for failure. And I also got the shirt to go with the yoga pants. And here is what it looks like. It just says pink on the front. And then, you know. Now, of course, it's winter time, so I'm not getting ready to wear a lot of this stuff right now other than maybe my yoga pants and things like that. But I like to get stuff on the off season because as soon as summertime hits, you you know, when you're running your errands, I know in the summertime, I throw on one of these little bad guys right here, run my errands, get your nails done, go to the beauty supply store, you know, whatever we do, go shopping, Sephora. So, yeah. Um... And I have some other stuff, but this is um, getting a little long for the Victoria's Secret part. So let me move to the next part. I'm going to do a rapid uh, haul because I got some more stuff from Victoria's Secret, but it wasn't necessarily for Christmas. It was more of the semi-annual sale that's going on like today. So I'll be there tomorrow too. All right, so I guess this is also going to be a what I got for Christmas, what I bought for my Christmas in a Black Friday haul because some of this stuff I got from uh, Ulta for Black Friday. Some of it is in my room, so I'll do the other part of that on the next video, but I wanted to show you all. I got this, um, it's called This Month's Fragrance Crush from Ulta. It was $14.99. I see a lot of people always talking about like different perfumes that they like so I figured I'd get this just to see like how I like which ones. I usually get the ones from Sephora but they're 60 bucks but they do come with a coupon for a free uh, bottle of cologne or perfume this, depending on which set you buy. But I just got this one and then you get a $5 off but I'll probably just go to Sephora and whichever one of these I like I'll just buy the bottle because it is not that serious for no $5 off. And it was only $14, so whatever. Um, and the things that I got in my stocking. It was a lot more than this, but I'll show you guys the makeup part. I got a Pixie Skin Treats Glow Tonic Exfoliating Toner. And um, let's see if it'll... So yeah, hopefully y'all can see that. Um, I got this, actually I bought this from Target and I just kind of threw it in my stocking. But I got this from Target because Tiff Jeff 069 I love her channel. She uh, said that this was a very, very good product to use. And I've been wanting to try it and I saw they had like the little stocking stuff or things at Target. So I just picked it up. I also placed an order with Lena Cosmetics. Lena Lashes um, Cosmetics. If you don't know or haven't heard of them, her lipsticks are amazing. I actually have some more of them, but I didn't get them for Christmas, so I'll put them in a rapid haul. But I will show you what I got for the uh, sale. She had a sale that was $3, so you know I had to jump on that. Then the next day she had a dollar sale, but I don't have time for that. Um, so the first thing I got was a Swamp Pop lip gloss and I got that in the color King Cake and here is the color and I'm going to go through this fast because I don't want this video to be super duper long y'all. I might have to do a part two or something. I don't know. 
I also got a more matte than matte. This is from the more matte than matte um, line, and this is in the color Claude. And that is what the color looks like. And I also got three of the baby, I think it's called baby matte um, from the baby matte line. I heard that, okay, so I purchased four or five of these and they're all sitting up there. That's why I'm looking. And when I tell y'all, when it say more matte than matte, baby, those things are so drying but they're beautiful the formula is amazing it's more matte than matte they never lied about that um so i heard that the baby mat this is one of them that i got and i heard that the baby mat was a little better as far as the formula is not as drying and i also heard that it doesn't necessarily dry down to a complete matte and that's why it's called baby mat like it dries matte but not completely matte so maybe this will be a little more comfortable this color is purple rain and is it gonna focus i don't know but it's called purple rain and as y'all can see i'm addicted to buying purple and neutral colors right now so don't mind me i also got another in y'all don't judge me for these colors i pick i don't know when i like a color i like gravitate towards it so i buy well it's not the same color but this color is called purple up and the last one that I got is, here I go again with the neutrals, My, Mild Brown. And it doesn't look like it's going to, I gotta figure this autofocus out y'all cause I don't wanna be sitting there holding it looking crazy. So this is what it looks like. I saw it on her Instagram page and when I say, I was like yeah, run me that Mild Brown, okay? beautiful gorgeous colors and for three dollars you can't beat that um the next thing i got was a lipstick and it was from the i think it was from the christmas collection last year i got a couple of them but i didn't get this color for some reason i don't know why but it's called dark side and this packaging y'all know this packaging is everything I love purple and pink but this is what dark side looks like it is a um like a dark burgundy color very very pretty so i got that and i picked up this shouldn't even be in this video but here i go with the purples again these are two well this is one of my favorite lipsticks from nika k it is in the color violet it's the first purple that i ever got because i was so afraid to try it and i saw it at the beauty supply for 99 cents and then i saw it again and then i bought it again like i don't have a million purples but here's another purple but this one is actually from it's called a morris a morris i don't know mm -mm. it's called be a legend and it was a dollar so i just want to try it y'all know how it goes i also got a lip pencil in the color magenta and then i looked up at my collection and realized guess what you already got one of those but i guess it'll be a backup so this is mac magenta lip pencil and last but not least i got a select moisture cover mac um concealer i couldn't think of the word and this is in nc50 which is actually my skin complexion so i got this because i've never had a liquid concealer from mac before so i wanted to try this and that is all i got for christmas well that's not all i got that's all for this video though so stick around and um make sure y'all watch part two of my video because like i said i don't want it to be too long so i'll see you guys in the next video thank you so much